Hello. It's Mona. So I told uh, Tawana Harris, I hope you're on Facebook right now, that I would uh, go live to talk about creating a stimulating environment, one that encourages you, uh, one that Sophie, Maylin, Raquel, oh my gosh, you guys are all online. Everybody's home in the snow, right? Um, bring them on camera. Okay. So, oh, Ad, I'm sorry. Oh, Lord. Ad. I haven't done um, Facebook Live. So just bear with me. And so anyway, um, Tawana asked how, if I would go Facebook Live to create, to, to show everyone how to create a stimulating environment. So um, let me get my little stick. So anyway, we're inside of my closet. And I want to show you what inspires me, how I stay motivated to stay on my goals. It's the beginning of the year, and we all had a snow day. Um, well, if you're in Massachusetts or on the East Coast, it's more than likely you had a snow day. Um, so anyway, I'm going to stop this because it's, I can't get into what I want to talk about. So in my closet, you'll see um, I have books on fashion. Hey, Fancy, how you doing? Hey, Nikki, that was so amazing making those, um, those hats for the American Heart Society. It's, that was awesome. If more of us could, hey, Orby, how are you doing? So anyway, I'm in my closet talking about, who's that? Yeah. Kathleen, how you doing? Um, so I'm in my closet talking about how to create a, an environment that stimulates you, that keeps you motivated, um, that encourages you because we all have times that we get really really down is that mom hi mom so my closet is a lot for some people but hey chris happy new year glad you made it back home safely we were praying for you um our international singer hey kathleen how are you so anyway i have all kinds of motivation in my closet i have words that inspire me. Um, I keep little rocks like this. This says dreams. I can always remember my dreams. Uh, this says smile. So, you know, you have to remember to smile. Yes, Dukenya, I helped you with your closet. That took all day. And you were a person that was like, I don't have anything to wear. Hey, Joanne, how you doing? Um, you were like, I don't have anything to wear. Uh, and we went through and we made enough outfits to last you an entire month. So I'll, once, once I start my vlog, <laughs> I'll teach people how to mix and match and do stuff in your closet. But today, because I told Tawana that I would share how to set up a stimulating and motivating environment, I wanted to just make sure that I kept my word, especially since we're only on the fourth day. Or is it the fifth day? I don't know what day we're on. Uh, fourth day in the new year. So I showed you my little stones. Then I also over here have like, I, I really, <laughs> this collection of mugs is like my friends. One year, I don't even know how it happened because some of them don't even know each other, but um, decided it was like that year I just kept getting mugs and I was like, oh my gosh, I'm going to have a collection of mugs. So this is awesome. So if you see over here, like one of my mugs says fancy, 
another is that Tawana no that's not Tawana one says fancy one says love I just got this one which is awesome rise and shine this one is when I'm feeling a little fancy and sexy coming in hot and then this is when I go shopping and I shouldn't oops I spent my grocery money on shoes again so then I have little things that remind me to be still rejuvenate those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength it's just a little tiny you know pillow I have and has um, potpourri on the inside and then I have all these globes I'm really into globes Shakira don't laugh at me and so I mean they play music it's just so nice this reminds me of shopping it says fabulous um, what else do I have in this closet oh okay this was a little gift someone bought me Mona is successful she makes it happen she's victorious so sometimes I play this and to remind me that the world is mine so you can make any environment stimulating all you have to do is figure out hi Vivian <laughs> you have to figure out what motivates you so I'm motivated by words um, I'm motivated by very pretty things. Um, <laughs> Margaret, what am I not into? That's, that's the thing. Um, oh, guys, I'm motivated by stuff. Like, that's my perfume collection. Hey, Faye, how you doing, Pastor Faye? Um, oh, and I have stuff like this. Because I'm a little girl at heart and I love sparkle. So, let me shake it up. Never let anyone dull your sparkle. Isn't that beautiful? Right? It's so nice. Then, one of my friends painted this for me. This was from our retreat last year. If you haven't registered, you might want to get on it. So, we did these bags. And then some people did canvases. So this is just a good reminder. Hi, Yemi. I come in this closet. I play. I put my little music on. And then I learn to be still. It's so important. The other way that I motivate myself is I have just words blessed and highly favored don't quit your daydream you know little pillows so yay the retreats coming up I'm so excited about it the other thing that I keep in my closet is my vision journal and those of you who have not read The Year of Yes. It's such an amazing book. So I had a, a picture of it and I just put it on the cover. This is like a old, if you're ever wondering what to do with those old journals that the date has passed by, this was an old journal from, I think 2004. Hey Loretta, I miss you. I haven't seen you in so long. Hey Jackie, how you doing? I miss you. So anyway, I took an old journal and I made it into a vision journal. If you, if you create vision boards, a vision journal is so amazing. Hey, Kimmy, it's so amazing to create because you can carry it with you anywhere and, and be reminded of what you're believing God for. So this is my vision journal that I did in July, so it'll go from July to July. Hey, Miss Karen, how you doing? So um, I just go, I do subconscious journaling, uh, vision boarding. So what that means is that you grab. Yes, doesn't a vision journal work? It, so I love vision journals. So I go through um, magazines and I 
uh, just pull out any picture, any word, any phrase that speaks to me. Oh, yes, that's awesome. Tasha, that's great. Um, trust me, you're going to love it. Um, so any word, any picture, any phrase that speaks to me, and then what I do is I divide it into categories. And, um, and then I just start putting it in my journal. So this is divided into like, you know, what I plan on doing for the year, working out. Um, I have style stuff in here. This is all, you know, I love this, finding your artistic voice, because I found that I wasn't doing as much creative stuff as I used to do. Um, so I just went through use the old old journal and and did a vision journal so i carry it with me and i left some spaces oh that's awesome jade i left some spaces for me to um do some writing because sometimes when i'm looking through uh, my journal i get really excited and i and it inspires me to write something so i left some blank space uh, pages so that i could write so I just, Happy New Year, LaToya. Um, so I just wanted to encourage you, it, you don't have to have a closet like this. You could have one little wall that you just put stuff on that inspires you and every time you look at it, you get super excited. Um, in my office, I created a wall that every time I look at it, it just inspires me. And so I find that when you keep stuff in front of you that makes you happy, makes you joyful, keeps you inspired, that you're, you're motivated to do better. Hey, Patricia, how are you? Um, so anyway, those are my little tips for today. And this was really for uh, Tawana Harris and Juliet Gomes. Um, oh, that, that's such a great idea. I know a lot of people, um, I think, hope I say your name right, Ciola, that do vision board parties with their friends. And the best thing about doing it with your friends is that you guys can hold each other accountable. Um, so like with my, there are certain things that I'll say to my friends, like make sure that I stay on top of this this year. And, and they make sure that I do. And so, and you can't get mad. Like if you say I want to lose weight and they see you eating potato chips, girl, you can't get upset. You just have to be like, I asked you to keep me motivated um so anyway oh thank you tasha so i'm trying to think if there's anything else oh the other thing um like in my closet i like there's certain things about me like let me show you right now hold on okay so for example i am high maintenance and i'm okay with that and I try to live the best life I can because enjoy life because this life is not a rehearsal. And so I keep things like that to motivate me, to keep me inspired. Oh, that's a, Michelle, that's a great idea to do a vision board party for your birthday because then you're blessing others as you're entering into a new year. So I think that's all I have to say all of my books that are in my closet i'm a bookaholic so all the books in my closet have to do with fashion um style makeup hair let's see what else oh and then i'm totally obsessed with paris so i have like little things on paris um Soon I'll be doing, like I said, I'll be doing a vlog and I'll be talking about different subjects every week. Um, oh, I also am totally into hearts. So I have like these little things all around my closet. Um, these are, they're called keyed hearts. This one is um, uh, love and kisses. And then my favorite one is this. Just reminding me to be a brave girl. And I encourage you to be a brave girl. Just live life to the fullest. Put stuff around you. 
I know, Michelle, I'm telling you. <laughs> That's why Pastor Matt says I'm a hot mess because I, I don't even know how I started collecting all this stuff, but um, yeah, I collect a lot of stuff and it's accidental. Sue Tatiana. Um, yeah, it's, it's too much. If I, if I started whipping out this collection, you guys would be like, I think there's something wrong with her. So as you can see, I collect fashion books, I collect perfume, I collect peacocks, um, globes. Oh, these are, this is another thing I collect. I'm so into these wine shoes, even though I don't drink wine. But aren't they so gorgeous? Every time I see one, I usually just see them at TJ Maxx. So whenever I see one at TJ Maxx, I'm like, I need that shoe. Patricia, I just showed um, Mindy. I love to purge too. So I just purged, even though it may not look like it. I gave away two uh, huge bags of perf uh, not perfume, makeup. Cause I don't even wanna show you my makeup, okay? So Patricia, I just showed my little mug. You'll understand. rise and shine and I showed my mug collection so anyway um, I just like I said I wanted to keep my word to Tawana and Juliet and let them know what stimulates me in terms of creating an environment that is encouraging um, that is motivating that keeps you uh, stimulated for all that you're believing God for you know I'm a girly girl, Sue. Um, and then, oh, let me show you my little, isn't this mirror fabulous? I Like, this is, I love this. And then, I love these. You can get them from Bath and Body, because sometimes just a good little spray is awesome. But I keep them in this to make it fancy. So it makes me feel like, mm, who doesn't love a good spray? Then I find stuff like this at uh, Michael's. It goes on sale all the time. Little boxes that have cute sayings on them. And yes, like uh, Ravine said, peacocks. Um, Kizzy, I have decluttered. Are you trying to say my room is cluttered? I don't know. I don't know about you and Mindy. You guys are not nice. Not nice at all. But anyway, this is my room. And hopefully all my words have inspired you the way they inspire me. And Nope, Kizzy, yep. Wait till I see you on Sunday, girl. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Wait till I see you. And I was going to have a prize today, but mm-mm. Oh! <laughs> you and Kizzy are tag teaming. It's so true. But anyway, um, I'm going to go back to relaxing. Yes, Caitlin, TJ Maxx and Home Goods in the new store, Home Sense in Westwood, um, are amazing. Hi, Stephanie. How are you? Uh, you're back from whatever island you were from. Um, excuse me, Stephanie. I hope you ordered what I told you to order on watch night because I'm coming for you today, okay? So have an awesome, snowed-in, spectacular day. Please, please, please watch out for my vlog. Oh, Susan, let's do it. Let's have a pretty party. Um, watch out for my vlog, but please, if you get a chance, please subscribe to Queen D. Mona YouTube because... That's where I'll be doing my vlog. Right now, it just has messages on it from Sunday. Yep, Stephanie, you didn't order it, did you? Huh. Oh, Lulu, how you doing? Yeah, we need to talk because, I, you know, your dolls are beautiful. Um, so anyway, on this Snowden day, please remember to be a brave girl because I 
in being so brave right now by letting you into my closet. Because as my granddaughter would say, I don't know if you should show that closet. And I only showed you guys a little piece. But on my vlog, I'm, I'm going in. And I don't care. Because either you're going to love me more or love me more. Okay? So, um, I'll do it today. That's all I'm going to say. Because I'm your sister. And I expected that to be done on Tuesday. So, Jackie! Jackie Jean, I love you! Girl, Yemi, I need a huge walk-in closet, too. That's why some people are coming at me. Because it probably looks like a lot because it's so small. Thank you. Van, I love you, too. So, with that, um, we will conclude... Because uh, I don't know what else to say right now. And... <laughs> oh, Pastor Nikkei, thank you. And I love you so much. Um, oh, my last word before I leave. Create. It makes you happy. So with that, it's been real. Hopefully, um, you can take some time this evening, get started on a vision journal, um, and I'll talk about that on the vlog as well, and we'll end with this. Sit and savor every last drop. Here's to love, to friends and family, to furry darlings, to adoration of every sort. Rejuvenate yourself, be an icon, love brilliantly. Brother Levi, that's all I'm going to say to you. That's all. So with that, see you guys later. And please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Right now it just has messages, but soon, yes, Stephanie... I play spa music when I'm in my closet. Thank you. Yes. I'm all about that life. <laughs> Good night.